hi guys welcome back to my channel welcome back to another video long time no see hope you're all good your girl's good i'm gonna do another video explaining where i've been what i've been doing your girl's just been doing stuff anyway as you can tell by the title this is a kind of organized my jewelry collection with me some might think this is a lot of jewelry some might think that it's nothing to me it's not big because i always tend to go for the same stuff i never really change up the jewelry pieces i wear i always have this necklace on and then like if i'm going out i'm going to show the pieces that i always tend to reach for but yeah we're gonna try and record this video real fast because <sighs> tay is just very clingy today the baby's very clingy he's sleeping alice is playing with tails so we're just gonna jump straight into this video but before we do get into this video i just want to take some time out to talk about my favorite jewelry brand and if you guys have been around my channel for a while a long time you guys would know who i'm talking about anna louisa their pieces can i just say are actually amazing i'm not one to brag or run about or talk about a jewelry brand but whenever people ask me like about jewelry brands where i get my jewelry from i always just say anna louisa because there's actually no words and i i used to be the person like i wouldn't want to spend like a lot of money on jewelry because i don't know i was just never a jewelry person i always thought that you know jewelry's gonna it's gonna stain it's gonna tarnish um start stripping changing color stuff like that like the quality is just bad it will break da, 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 da. but i can actually say all the anna louisa jewelry i've had that i've worn immaculate there's just no words <laughs> there's no words but yeah so just gonna drop straight into the video but i just definitely wanted to talk about it because let me tell you the thing with me and when it comes to spending like money i'm not talking about 10 20 pound but i'm speaking talking about like a decent amount of money i always don't go off the first video that someone says but like they're showing you stuff i like to wait for like the reviews or do you get what i mean like people actually giving their opinions after having the item for some time i've had this mama necklace that i'm wearing right now as you guys can see i've been wearing this non-stop since the first time i got it which was about coming up to two years so this in december will be about two years since i've had it because i think i got it december 2021 and we're in um august 2023 absolutely love this necklace let me tell you what this necklace has been through i've slept in it i've showered in it i've bathed in it i've gone swimming in it i've just done a whole bunch hey you know when i gave birth to Isaiah? i was wearing and i didn't even realize until i was looking back at the pictures the other day and i was like oh my gosh i wore that necklace so this necklace went through five hours of labor and delivery with me with no pain medication no nothing just got in there this necklace went through everything i went through in that five hours so this necklace has been through a lot i'm not gonna lie and it is actually guys look how immaculate condition there's just actually no words to explain it but yeah as you can tell i'm always wearing it this is my favorite necklace on them and if i'm not wearing this this is like my everyday necklace and if i'm like going out somewhere we kind of got to dress up a bit or whatever let me show you the pieces that i tend to reach for which are also from anna louisa Jordan. nobody can tell me nothing when I put these on, oh my gosh, they don't come together, they come separate. But I actually managed to find it on the website that is the same. Oh my gosh. Oh, anybody, whenever we're going out, this is what I reach for. I'm very insecure about some stuff, we're gonna be real. But, Stephen, I'm wearing these with a nice outfit. Nobody can talk to me. Nobody can talk to me because, love, I'm just gonna show you quite quick what it looks like but yeah i absolutely love it so this is the necklace and then you just got a matching bracelet in my favorite jewelry color which is gold so i'm sure everything that i have from anna louisa is gold because i'm like a gold jewelry person i even have this bracelet that i got from anna louisa the last time it's actually like that and let me tell you i'm saving it for tail now you see it still has the tag this is going to be Taya's. When she gets to that age, this is going to be hers. I think it is adjustable. It is. So she could really start wearing it from now, but yeah, we're going to wait a little bit. But yeah, it's adjustable. Guys, I actually love Anna Louisa jewelry. I'm really, just really happy that I actually came across them. And now I'm like working with them. They're actually amazing. Anyway, so yeah, this is my favorite necklace. And then this is my favorite set from them the color kind of looks different to me on my camera i don't know why 
but they are exactly the same color these i've showered in i've bathed in i've i've done a lot in these two but absolutely love them the condition is amazing the color hasn't stripped hasn't tarnished nothing it is still looks brand new nice and shiny there's no off coloring nothing is actually so good and can i just take an opportunity to say that now they are actually starting to offer um two year warranty instead of one so if something happens to your jewelry pieces and you're not happy with it you can you've got that extra year warranty so it's no longer one year it's two years which i think is actually really good so yeah i wear this every day wear those when we're going out like i said this is for Taya. i have so many more pieces from them i know i gave one to destiny as a gift like christmas time that video is on my channel go check it out and then i have actually lent a few to another friend so i can't show you guys those today but i will try to link all the videos down below of, like all the videos i've done showing off the pieces i have from them just so you guys can see like, all the stuff i've got over time but they are so nice the thing of me when it comes to jewelry is that jewelry is supposed to make you feel good i like it's supposed like i'm supposed to get dressed up feel good and then put jewelry on and feel that much better and i feel like sometimes i put jewelry on say like i have stuff on like primark and stuff and i put the hoops in and i just don't feel better and i feel like what's the point of wearing it tonight don't wear it but this set here sorry i'm gonna rant about it yeah i just you know when you feel untouchable like nobody can have any sort of chat for you nothing because yeah that just makes me feel amazing and i feel like after just having two kids you have to say back to back they're like two years apart um sometimes you just don't always feel good about yourself but sorry but this jewelry sometimes it just it's that confident booster that i need when i'm going out and i feel like that's what's important about jewelry and if your jewelry isn't doing that for you then you definitely need to switch up your jewelry and head over to anna louise so, but yeah that's what i gotta say but i want to show you um two other pieces that they sent me because my girls i have to show you what i got so it's the little note and then tell you how fast up myself in the box but that's fine the first thing i got are these little hoops that are actually for taya um like i said she's got a little jewelry collection going on sorry i have anna louisa she needs to have anna louisa too this is the earrings hope you can actually see that if you can't see it properly i will insert a picture on the screen but it's just this little double hoop and then it's just got little studs going around there can you see that i think you can yeah so i've got those little silver earrings for her alice is more of like a silver jewelry kind of person so he usually buys her silver so i thought i'd pick silver for her and then i got myself this gold pendant necklace it's so cute it's so small yet so nice look at the pendant i haven't actually taken out the packaging i should so you guys can see it properly give me a second here is the necklace and let me just show you guys the little heart pendant i think it's so stay still i think that's so adorable so i'm gonna wear that soon and let me just tell you the little packaging that they send like your jewelry in looks something like this i keep them because you know like you're going out for the night or you're going away for the weekend i just grab one and put my jewelry and i'm sorry i actually keep them so these are a different one and then possible my friend has two this was one this is one i actually keep them i'm sure i have more and i always keep like the little notes that i get so, so yeah i usually keep them yeah these are like the little things that they come on oh yeah they're just so good they're also eco-friendly good for the environment you guys know that but like i said they're just really nice easy to put your jewelry in when you're going away for the weekend it's easy to just pop into your little shoulder bag got your little clutch if you're going out for the night and feel like you just feel comfortable with like you know sometimes you're out and coming towards the end of the night you just want your hoops out you just want your earrings out it's just easy to take with you put it in and put it in your bag and boom bam boom yeah anyway so that is everything so good guys don't forget to go check out anna luisa i'm gonna put the clickable link in the description box below so when you click it it'll just take you straight to the website and if you guys will order anything or would like to order anything then definitely use my code i'm going to put on the screen also put in the description box below it is shanique 20 and that will get you 20 percent off of your ada louisa purchase and yeah guys just definitely check out the website they've got something for everyone like they've got good priced stuff they have high-end price stuff but they also have like really good affordable um stuff on it that's why i always say that there's something for everyone on that website because 
it's actually quite affordable and then they've got more high-end stuff but even if it's not for yourself christmas is coming up you know you've got gifts for people i just feel like jewelry is always a nice gift to give like a parent a friend a sibling grandparents you know so definitely go check them out but yeah just want to say thank you to anna louise again for working with me in this part of today's video okay cool so don't nobody come for me don't nobody say nothing but this i'm actually embarrassed to show but this is my jewelry box it looked a bit better before me recording the first part of today's video but this is what we're working with i've had this jewelry box no joke since like the first year of six months i was about 17 years old when i bought this and i'm now going to be 24 next month and i still have this so i've had it six years and it's still going strong let me tell you this it's actually in really good condition still i clean it like really often like every other week but it's just too big and I was going to use it for Taya, but Taya actually has a jewelry box. So I think I'm going to keep this and use it for something else. But it's definite that I definitely need to invest in a bigger jewelry box. But as you can tell, you can actually tell that there's stuff I just don't wear because they're still on like packaging. It's actually bad. So we're actually going to go and sort it out now. I'm going to lay everything out and show you guys everything. Some of this stuff is like being gifted to me. So some stuff from Louisa, some stuff like I don't remember what friend. And that sounds really bad, but a friend bought this for me. It's an anklet from like when they went on holiday. I can't tell you what friend it was, but it was a friend. Um, Primark studs, you can tell what I've worn out was still on there. It's just, it's a whole bunch. So it's very clear. I do need to order myself a new jewelry box. I've just been looking. I was trying to find one for this video, but I just actually couldn't find one that I liked. I'm so picky when it comes to stuff, but I'm sure Alice has got drawing hair too. So obviously needs to find him one too, but I'm going to lay this out and we're going to, show you guys what we're working with and we're going to try and get rid of like stuff i'm not wearing taya has got jewelry in here as well i think so i'm going to take these out put them into her one um but yeah we're just going to try and make this whole situation look a bit better and like easier to find stuff so let's just jump straight into this video not me talking about i like, clean it but then i've taken like the jewelry out and like why does it look like this like there's crumbs why we've got Taya's hairband we've got Alice's little ball things we've got like the backs from like you know when you get earrings these are scratches that I've now realized out there whatever that is we've got a pin nail clippers I don't even know what oh my gosh this came off my necklace oh shit guys this is, this is off of a necklace but I don't know if you can see, you know I don't know if you can see it says see what it says stars and then a heart and then shandy yeah he got me this for valentine's they um i think it was 2021 so cute and then yeah i'm sure these are like odd earrings so let's just yeah i think my plan of what i wanted to do is i do want to get like those ikea um alex drawers you know and then i saw that on amazon they do like the little drawer inserts for jewelry so i feel like that's what i want to do so i feel like once i get the draw and get the inserts we can do like a part two or something to this video of like proper organization of how it will be but for now we're just going to take like tear stuff out and basically anything that doesn't need to be in there we're going to take it out take all the stuff out like the packaging and then anything that i really know i'm not going to wear then i feel like we're just going to actually get rid of it but we're just trying to make it look a bit better and then maybe i will start going for like other jewelry pieces that's in there and not just the same like set you know so yeah, let's just jump straight into this video. All right, cool. So this is everything out. Literally just got like a whole bunch of stuff. So yeah. yeah. So we're just gonna, I'm just gonna put them into piles. So I'm gonna do like earrings in a pile. I'm gonna do like necklaces, bracelets, anklets, and then stuff that's not supposed to be there. It can go like back there or something. This is Alistair's. This is a choker. Never worn it. Never will I wear it either. So you know that's gonna get gone. This one once. I don't think I'll wear it again. But I'm gonna keep this. 
my faves. Okay, that's rubbish now. So bracelet, earrings, so anchor. Right, cool. This is everything laid out on my kitchen counter. We're gonna excuse that. But yeah, this is everything laid out on my kitchen counter. So that's like the rest of the studs on the thing. Alistair's. This is all my hoops. I feel like it's a lot. One, these two are missing. This is actually my favorite one. I had it lost. I think I lost both of them. Bought it back, and now I've lost one again. Clearly, because it's just not here. So that's really annoying. But yeah, I've just got these are like my favorite currently. Yeah, that's just my little hoop collection. Then onto bracelets, I basically don't have none. These my uncle got for me one time from like a different country with an outfit. I haven't worn an outfit nor have I worn these, but I just don't want to get rid of them. Then this is my Anna Luisa one. And then this is my guest one that my nan got for me for Christmas like two or three years ago. I wear this a lot. Um, then onto rings, I just have this one that I've never worn. And then this one, which is my promise ring. And then here's like, or like the studs stuff that I have no business being there so I've got a key ring a pin sunglasses that I don't wear and then this was from when I went to that um festival weekend thing and then here's like ankle bracelets this is the one I said a friend bought for me from a different country I don't remember if it was it's out of two friends I feel like it was Adriana I want to say I feel like Adriana got me this from Portugal not sure but someone got it for me but was it amy it was a friend it was a friend then these three i got from when we went to great yarmouth about two years ago um i've worn this one i've not worn these two hence why they're still on the package but i didn't want to take them off and then this one which was from asos i think i've worn it once but it is nice and then moving on to necklaces i thought i just laid them out so you guys can see them properly this is the one that he got engraved um for valentine's day i just have this one from river island this one just says big sister this is a choker i've never worn i don't think i'll wear it i'm just not a choker kind of girl this is a cross one this one is the one that came with my promise ring from alistair got this one for heart this chunky one that i wore once i don't think i'll wear it again i just wasn't a fan this is the one i just got from anna luisa this is another anna luisa one this one i don't remember where it's from but i've never worn it and i've never worn this one either and then this here is two necklaces that are just I've been trying to pick at it and it's just not happening and then I think this is another necklace and then these are like Taya stuff that were in mine so this is this little bear necklace for her but she's not wearing it it's too big then she's got like this little anklet um yeah, she can wear it next to summer and then this is the Anna Luisa one I said was for her then she got this pair of earrings from my mom's mom but the other one is in her jewelry box so I need to put those in there so yeah that's what it is i think what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna try and put some of them in like these bags and put like my rings in this and then some of my hoops i think just to try and organize it a bit more so let's just do that real quick and then i'll show you guys how it looks after right, cool finished organizing now this is how it looks i'm gonna show you guys what i put where and yeah we're just gonna go so the box in this one it has all of my hoop earrings that actually looks like a lot that's crazy but that's my hoops inside this one is like the little studs and the cross necklace this is Anna Luisa note in this little box I have the other ring and then the promise ring and the necklace that matches it here is just bracelets I think I'm just gonna put them in a drawer box just like that and then in here I have my bracelets which is only two that's crazy but yeah in here has my necklace I don't know if you can tell but inside this one it has like two sides so you have the back and then you also have the front so there's necklaces on both sides in here is like tiered stuff. This is the brace, the necklace that I need to untangle. Another note, here is just the anklet bracelets. I think I'm just gonna put those in like that. And then it's just got the two spare bags that um, I do like what I used to say I do. So I just like put jewelry in if I'm going away for the night. And then here's the box which just has the rest of the anchor bracelets, the big necklaces and the studs. That is this organized. I'm gonna put in the jewelry box and then show you guys what it looks like. And then we're done.
this is the finished product this is how it's looking i just feel like it's so much easier i'll remember what's in what and it'll just be so much easier to find stuff and hopefully i can keep it organized until i'm able to get the drawers and then that will be another video of us organizing when we get the alex drawers all i have left is this necklace to detangle and we're all good and it just looks and feels so much better so that is the end of today's video i'm really glad that we was able to sort out my jewelry box and just make it look a bit better but after after this video i am gonna go and try and hunt and see if i can find a nice one but i think i'm just gonna go with the plan of like when i get the drawers to just get it in sets and have the jewelry in there and then maybe find like a necklace kind of stand and have like the necklaces on there i think that would be better and then also try and find one for alistair but this is the end of this video it's just this one necklace left that is tangled but i'm getting there i'm getting there but yeah um don't forget to like comment and subscribe if you haven't already turn your post notifications on so that you're notified every time i post a video don't forget to click click the link in the description box below that will take you straight to Anna Louisa jewelry website and don't forget to use my code sneak 20 to get you 20 percent off I'm not sure if i did say but when it comes to the jewelry um in terms of cleaning it i wouldn't use any like harsh chemicals or anything i usually just use like um a jewelry cloth or even like cotton balls and just wipe it off you're supposed to do it after every use i won't lie to you guys and say i will i don't but it's only when i feel like it's necessary and i see that it needs to that's when i do it but yeah i just want to say thank you again to my girls at anna louisa for working with me again in today's video i hope you all take care i'll see you all in my next video bye guys what what the hell did i do? what was that anyway bye guys